Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Very quick video today. I've seen a lot of questions lately about how to get those badges. Silver, gold, platinum, diamond. How do you get those badges to upgrade your players? So to cut to the chase, there are two ways you can get these badges. First way, go into the shop and just buy them um, for gems. You know, 400 gems gets you six silver badges, gold, 800, platinum, 2,000, diamond, 3,500. So if you're going to buy that, it's going to cost you, uh, you know, like 30 bucks if you want to get six diamond badges. So I honestly would recommend you never to spend that much money on just badges. This game is pretty ludicrous with their shop but the second way the free way is to play through games you know i have a ton of videos the challenges where i get those badges from just playing games it'll pop up here as a special match reward if you win the game you'll get the badge so those you definitely want to play yourself don't leave it a chance don't leave it to the computer quit the game reset the inning if you have to whatever you need to do to get that badge go for it and unfortunately, those are the only ways. There's nothing you can do if you don't want to pay the money to make those appear faster, quicker. Um, generally, over one season, you'll probably get a handful of badges um, to upgrade your players with. But it really is random. I haven't kind of sat down and looked through exactly how many you get per season. But there's no way to get them from coins. You can't get them from stamina, from watching videos. If you're free to play, the only way is to play the games and it might even pop up as a post-match reward or maybe a reward for finishing out the season. So any of those random rewards, you can also get them, I guess there is another way, through achievements. So we see here, um, I've completed a bunch, but there's still a couple. You can get some uh, badges through 25 player recruiting, win the postseason 20 times, win the league. So that is another way, but those are limited once you finish all those achievements that's going to be it so these are useful to upgrade your players you're going to need five to upgrade them from bronze to silver and then five gold ones from silver to gold five platinum ones gold to platinum five diamond ones so on and so forth so that's all i have for you today uh actually before i end the gems method uh if you do want to do some free gem offers I mentioned that a lot. That's how I was able to get a lot of recruit tickets. I haven't used those gems on badges though. You can scroll through these. Maybe you see an easy one. Uh, do it. A lot of people have been saying that they've had problems with these. It's not available in every region. Your mileage may vary. But in general, I try to avoid um, the surveys. Uh, you know, I'll do some app ones. And I have play credit from google play rewards so if i see one that's like spend 2.99 in-game purchase i'll just do it because it's not my money if you have that app you can get money for answering surveys on google rewards opinion surveys something like that um but the other the other thing is if you've done a offer and you haven't had the gems go here to reward status um, it'll show you everything you have so if you have open things have you clicked on might not have been paid out and you can request you can contact their support and they usually will get back to you, help you out if you haven't had the gems credited to your account yet so another way to get you some gems uh gems i usually use on recruit tickets uh when when i first started playing it helps you out a ton but i guess if you have extra left over you want to get like these silver gold badges go for it uh, diamond platinum it's it's expensive but you know this game's hard. That's kind of one of the main complaints. It's hard to get upgrades if you're free to play. I know it's hard. That's why I try to give you guys ways to get free things, free coins, free gems, free, you know, upgrades. But there is a limit to it, and there's only so much you can do. So quick video today, but let me know if you have any other questions down in the comments below. I'll be here to answer them and or other ways that you've found you're able to get some coins or gems you can share with the community join the community discord talk about the game give each other some ideas that's all i have for you today though like the video subscribe 
Thanks for watching. Peace.